Hey YouTubers, today I'm going to show you a quick tip on how to manage your paint cans if you're working out of paint can for a while and you'll find that the paint can build up on the rim of your can. I'm going to show you exactly how it can build up and cause problems and then I'll show you how to resolve it. This is the problem that we encounter if we don't manage our paint cans properly you can see how the paint has built up around the edge of this can over time and the lid can't close properly and that's just going to cause all kinds of problems with using latex or oil we don't want air getting in drying up our paint in the can and contaminating it so how do we deal with this problem? I'll show you so to resolve any problems with paint buildup around the rim of your can, we want to open up the can, use our 5 in 1 tool, and then before we go any further we just take a hammer and we just insert our 5-in-1 tool, use the pick tool, insert it into the rim of the can and pierce a hole every few inches. If you don't use a 5-in-1 tool, just a common household nail will do. And then, when you pour the paint, clean out the rim of the can, the paint will drain down in here. And even if you get lazy and don't brush the paint out of the rim of the can, it should drain through and it will allow your lid to seal down. And the seal is made between the lid and this outer ridge here, and then it allows the paint to drop through the holes. So, I hope you enjoyed that quick tip how to keep the rim of your paint cans clear of debris. If you apply that, that'll stop the paint from building up and causing problems. And I do this especially with containers that I know I'm going to have left over or I'm going to be returning to that can of paint in the future. This might be just a reminder for you, but it's good to get into these habits and it causes us less problems as we endeavor to do our projects. So if you have any comments or questions about this video or any others, if you have a suggestion for a video, by all means leave it and I'll try to get to it. You could subscribe as well. Until next time, it's been Craig, the Muskoka Painter, helping you take the paint out of paint.